Hello everybody, my name is Dana Ring. Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X HD Remastered Edition. I haven't played this game in a hot minute. I say that a lot of times because I am very sparse with recording. Are you guys ready to solve some puzzles with me? Because I'm sure that I'm so positive that I'm probably not going to get through this whole cloister trial in one episode. If I do, it'll probably be a pretty long episode. Alright, let's go. Look at this blue one. What's your gimmick? Oh, okay. Let's begin. I'm like, like half visible. Alright, cool. I was just a ghost for a second. Whoa, this is cool. This is like, like, confirmed direct- Oh, no. You're gonna give me a maze? Oh, this is not what I expected. Oh, me, oh my. Okay, oh, uh, wait. Wait, wait, hello. Um, excuse me. Was I able to interfere? Yeah, now I begin again. Hi, hey there, hello, okay. And now I, and now I go. Can I, I, Can I confirm a direction? Excuse me? Alright, well, I guess we're going forward again. This is not... This, this is... Oh, okay. Uh, that's going the other direction. I, I, I fight against the tides. So be it. Did I do it? Holy shit, I did it. I'll take that. Bevel spear. Sphere. It's not a spear. Don't stab people. Wait. Wait. Put that back. Insert. Take that one. What is that? What is gonna happen? Okay. Now I now I put two in. Oh no. Okay, so I... S Look at that guy. Oh my god. This is gonna kill me. I cannot... I can't even turn right there. What? Uh, you know, I thought they, they wouldn't have anything more, like, just... I, I wouldn't think that they would have something like before. Like, or more of. Go that way. But they just... I don't know. I'm just gonna complain forever, I guess. Okay, so... What if I, I... I took the sphere from there. Now I put the sphere in here. What will that create? Oh! I've bridged... I've bridged the networks. Perfect! I did it. All right. Well, what did that do exactly? Let's find out. <clears throat> uh, uh, okay. Okay. I really don't have much control over this. Do I, do I just turn around? I begin again. Is it like an infinite loop? Because that's what it looks like. It's just an infinite loop of forever. Go that way. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just mashing X. That way. This is a weird way of transportation that they've created. That way. No. <clears throat> I just, I think I just fell off the edge. I would like to confirm my forward direction. Thank you. I guess I'll figure out the controls. Stop. Stop. Oh, I did it. Forward onto Don. Oh, that's a that's a sphere. I guess I'll take that, maybe. Maybe. There's a glyph sphere. Oh, that's a different sphere. I guess. 
wonder what the glyph spheres do. There's a... There's a thing that looks like a glyph right there. Does that create new directions? That's my assumption. Well, I guess I'll figure it out. How long do you think it took them to make this game? That's an interesting question. I might look that up after this. Because, like... I'm getting interested in, like, game dev and stuff, and I'm, like, making two of, like, the shittiest games of all time right now. Uh, and... I don't know, I'm interested to see, like, how the development of this game went down. Especially because it was, like, back in, like... I have no idea, that's another thing I don't know. Like, when did this game come out? Like, 2005? If I got that right, I'm, like, the greatest man of all time. What do we, what do you need? In the uh, glyph sphere, because I got one of those. <clears throat> Open up. Oh my god. I'm so good at this. Destruction sphere. I will take it. Insert. Perfect. Let's keep on going. We don't need that bridge open anymore because I already got the thing okay maybe this won't be so bad maybe I'm just the greatest person at solving puzzles ever I mean a lot of a lot can change in like two weeks since the last time I played this or I guess in like a few months since I when was the last cloister trial that's interesting that's interesting to know because I have no idea because like these episodes usually come out like once every like Never. It's very, very sparse with the uh, these. What have you got for me? What, what, what is it? I can't see. I guess I'll. I guess I gotta find out. I like to go left, please. Thank you. That looks important. Whoa. Wait, was that it? Wait a minute. Wait, turn around. There's a thing up there. Uh, I'm gonna try that again and then just like mash X. <clears throat> because now that I'm thinking, I don't think there's anywhere else I could go anyway there might be i don't think so though i'm just gonna can i turn i can't no, nothing can be done all right well i guess i'll just go this way then figure something out i don't like this i'm gonna i'm just putting it out there right now like the <sighs> The thing with before is, I guess it wasn't really that bad because I could just move back and forth, and I, like, there. This is like this. This just adds another degree of like fuck you to it. Excuse my language, but like, it's just like it's just. I I don't know, man. The movements and stuff, and how I gotta move around. Oh wait a minute, I'm an idiot. What if? put that there what did I do okay maybe that wasn't it I don't have another glit sphere so I can't put one there was I supposed to no there's a glyph sphere there before right maybe or was the passage available then do I need to destroy the path so I can open it or something? Oh. Um. Okay. Let's go see if that worked. It's a cool concept, but I don't like it either because it takes forever. It's a, it's a slow movement type of deal that you don't have a whole lot of control over. And, uh, not a big fan of it. It's just, it's just lowers the, the efficiency of this. 
by an even higher degree. Also, I can't even view the place in its entirety, so I just gotta just I just gotta wing it. Just like think like I gotta remember everything. Whatever. Still a good game though. Just this part I don't like. You know, like you can have a favorite game, but you can still have like one portion where you're just like, this sucks. Kind of like the Demiux boss fight in Kingdom Hearts 2. But that didn't really suck. It was just like extremely difficult. And like everyone got really pissed off. I remember when I was a small child. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm a genius. I remember when I was a small child and I sucked at video games. I couldn't beat the Demiux boss fight in Kingdom Hearts 2. And I literally like, like I would, I would do this. I would start a new game. And just play through the game again until I reach that point. And that, that was my designation of like, I reached the end of the game. And then I got then I got better. HP sphere. Nice. That probably did something important. Oh no, that that's like for like the level up thing. The place. I know what to do. I know what to do. Um There's a I will put that sphere in that thing. If I can't can I push it? Maybe I can't. Maybe I do have to put oh, cause the, the wire thing is going here. Yeah, okay. I'm learning. I'm figuring oh, okay. I'm figuring things out. I know how to play video games. Yeah? Oh, okay. Maybe I don't actually need to put really really uh you're testing me here. You kidding me? Um. All right. Well, I'll, I'll go then. Okay. Bye. Did I solve it? Probably didn't. It's probably like a whole lot more. If you keep your expectations low, then you'll never be disappointed. This is a long loading screen. Yuna? Hey! Inside, maybe? Then what are we standing here for? Hey! You can stuff your taboos! Thanks, Kimari. What's that? A faith. They join with the summoner, and together receive the Aeon. They are human souls, imprisoned in stone by ancient Yevon rites. The dead should be allowed to rest. Oh, that's the... Oh! That's the purple dude from, like, the beginning. <gasps> Yuna! Did you fuck things up? Oh. There's the last of them. You are to stand trial. <laughs> I expect it will be a fair trial. <laughs> of course it will. Oh. Oh no, we got Bale. Oh, I know who that is. 
I know who that is. He's been summoned by like crazy people. He's he's the destroyer of worlds or something. He's not really, but like I know he's like a big deal. Oh man, uh, I'm not ready for this. I didn't th I didn't think about how we get a new Aeon. Oh shit. Okay. <clears throat> okay. 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 I need to. I need to. I need to control myself. I need to think about this. You're not naming him Battery Acid. Perfect. Now, I'm pretty sure this is either the final or the second to final Aeon. So far, we've accumulated Cloyster, Base 69, 420, uh, Han Solo, um, what was the, uh, what was the Ice Lady's name? Shit, uh, I don't remember. And Skeletor. I'm a big fan of our of our group of people. All right, cool. Yes, I would like to save my game, please. Thank you. I don't want to do that maze, uh, maze puzzle, whatever, ever again. Even though I did kind of just like, like, blast its b hole open, I just, yeah, whatever. You know, I'm happy. I guess. I thought it would take forever. Is now in session. The sacred offices of this court seek nothing but absolute truth in Yevon's name. To those on trial, believe in Yevon and speak only the truth. Maester Kelk Ronso. Summoner Yuna. You have sworn to protect the people of Yevon, true? Yes. Then consider. You have inflicted dire injury upon Maester Seymour Guado. Conspired with the Albed and joined in their insurrection. These are traitorous and unforgivable crimes that disturb the order of Yevon. Tell this court what possessed you to participate in such violence. Your Grace. The real traitor is Maester Seymour. He killed his father Jiskel with his own hands. What is this? Hmm? Haven't you heard? Not only that, Maester Seymour is already dead. It is a summoner's sacred duty to send the souls of the departed to the far plane. Yuna was only doing her job as a summoner. Grand Maester Micah, please send Seymour now. Send the unsent to where they belong? Yes. <laughs> Maester? Send the dead? Hmm? Uh. Oh my god. You would have to send me too. What? Grand Maester Micah is a wise leader. Even in death, he is invaluable to Spira. <laughs> Enlightened rule by the dead is preferable to the misguided failures of the living. Life is but a passing dream, but the death that follows is eternal. Men die, beasts die, trees die, even continents perish. Only the power of death truly commands in spirit. 
You're a shithead. Just die already. Its power is futile. But what of sin? I am a summoner, my lord. Like my father before me. I am on a pilgrimage to stop the death that sin brings. Are you... Are you telling me that too is futile? <sighs> Grand Maester Micah, I am not alone. All the people who have opposed sin, their battles, their sacrifices, were they all in vain? <laughs> Not in vain. No matter how many summoners give their lives, sin cannot be truly defeated. Their rebirth cannot be stopped. Yet the courage of those who fight gives the people hope. There is nothing futile in the life and death of a summoner. Never futile, but never ending. Hmm. Indeed, that is the essence of heaven. Lord Micah. Heaven is embodied by eternal, unchanging continuity, Summoner. No. That can't be right. Those who question these truths, they are traitors. Lord Micah! This is pretty, like, bogus. Oh my god. Get me out of here! I want out now! You can fit through that. You hear me? You waste your breath. Oh my god. Man, I hope Yuna's okay. You can fit through those bars. Mm. I can break She's strong. Cuffs. She'll make it. She'll make it? What, so she can die? <sighs> Why is it... Everything in Spira seems to revolve around people dying. Ah, uh, the spiral of death. Huh? Summoners challenge the bringer of death, sin, and die doing so. Guardians give their lives to protect their summoner. The faith are the souls of the dead. Even the maesters of Yevon are unsent. Spira is full of death. Only sin is reborn, and then only to bring more death. It is a cycle of death, spiraling endlessly. Only death cannot die. What the fuck? <sighs> That's some pretty deep, cool stuff. Come out. Your sentence has been decided. Sentence? Don't you mean execution? Really, now, what person would execute a dear friend? I hate you. You would. Ooh. Roasted. Toasted. Burnt to a crisp. Got him. We're gonna die by firing squad. Oh no, you're gonna drown me. Looks like you're next. Did Orin die? What? Next for what? What? Ha, <clears throat> ah, joke's on you. I can breathe underwater. You idiot. Get going. Where's everybody else? Floating down there somewhere, maybe. Kitten yelled that under the water, probably. Because not only does he have gills, but he can also talk perfectly normally while inside water. Ooh, you made it!
What's our sentence? Think they expect us to give up and die down here? Oh, well, that's a lame way to kill someone. <laughs> Where's Uni? I don't know. Wonder if we should wait for her. Hmm. Let's wait at the exit. If there is an exit. That is pretty lame. Especially because, like, I know those spikes are like. How oh, fares oh, okay. The so it seems my father's murder troubles him. <laughs> Ever the Ronzo. Hard headed, hardly useful. However, the summoner Yuna. Daughter to High Summoner Brasco. She may be of some use to us alive. She has disturbed the order of Yevin. She cannot be allowed to live. I understand. Let it go, Seymour. No one thrown into the Via Purifico has ever survived. Yet, there is always a small chance that they might. Place guards at the exit, kill any who emerge. Sir, leave that to me. Oh, first your father, now your bride. Allow me to do this because she is my bride. Wait, I will go too. You do not trust me? Would you trust a man who murdered his father? Very well. As you wish. Via Perifico. A, a swimming pool. Lady Yuna, forgive me. To the condemned. Stone panels are scattered throughout the Via Perifico. Step on one to transport. Oh. This is what it is. I thought the Via Purifico was like the, like the was like the pool where they just like get purified or whatever. Stone panels are scattered throughout the Via Purifico. Step on one to transport yourself to the next panel in the indicated direction. Nothing will happen if there is no panel to receive you at the far end. Oh snap! Am I playing as Yuna? Dude, nice. Oh, they can't level you up. That's bogus. Okay, well, since you have... Uh, what? Oh, right, I don't have any allies right now. Okay, well, let's continue. Actually, let's save. Yeah! It's been a half hour. Let's, uh, let's, uh, do some little saving. Let's save on this old one. Yeah, okay. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for this episode, everybody. I just bumped my mic and hit my, my controller on it. That was wonderful. I'm glad you all could hear that. Alright, well... Yeah, this is Final Fantasy X HD Remastered Edition or whatever. My name is Dana Ring. Um, oh, I should uh, I should add, um, I have a review blog now. Yeah, where I write reviews for games and stuff. It's like small like indie games, but they're cool. Because like, it, it, it's, it's good for both people because the developer gets an insight on someone who's good at writing, me, and then you guys get to see like cool games that are like, you know, they're like eight bucks and they're like a fun little thing to pick up. There's like a few games on there. There's going to be more. You should, uh, you should, uh, you should go check it out. This is danereviews.tumblr.com. It's just Dane Reviews. No space. Just Dane Reviews. I'll, I'll put it in the description or whatever. All right, cool. Like and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. I love you. Bye.